back to my channel so I posted a picture on Instagram showing you guys my work bag and so many of you guys that requested for me to do a what's inside my bag video and I love these videos just because I'm kind of nosy not gonna lie I want to see what people carry with them and like what makes them feel super productive and want to get things done so I work from home as many of you guys know and my office is here at my house, but sometimes I just get cabin fever, especially with the winter, and I'm just like, I need to go somewhere, like have a nice cup of tea, relax, have some lunch, and then I'll bring all my work stuff with me so that I can get some work done. So I'll go to Starbucks or I'll go to Sip Coffee House, which is one of my favorite cafes. It's so cute. So I'm gonna share with you guys what is inside, and yeah, let's get right into it. This bag right here is a Louis Vuitton Never Full MM, and I think it's a really decent size it's good now I usually don't bring everything that I have inside of here I usually just bring one planner or sometimes not even a planner and just my laptop but this is like a full packed on bag whenever I know I want to be there for several hours so let me begin with my laptop right here and I am obsessed with this cover I've had it for quite a while now and I got it from someone who actually makes them by hand and I think she closed down her shop I'm not not sure if she reopened it again um, I don't know if it was permanent or not or maybe she just went on vacation but I'll have links down below where you guys can find everything that I mentioned so this right here is the MacBook Pro and this is the 13 inch and this is my baby it's such a good work computer so I have that with me I also make sure to bring my headphones because if I'm editing a video I want to make sure that I can listen clearly without disrupting anybody else so I'll just bring along with me my headphones then I have two planners so the first planner right here this one is the happy planner and I actually customize the cover myself I showed you guys in a plan with me video how I set up my planner for 2019 so I'll just give you guys a little preview of what it looks like and then I also made a vision board with my goals for 2019 then I have like the places that I traveled last year and some of my favorite vacations and memories with my friends and family and then also my family in the back and I don't have pictures of everybody some people just don't like taking pictures so I don't have them on there but I do have a couple of my favorite memories here and then I have just some um, sticky notes on this side and then over here is how I like to decorate it. I like to go all out. It keeps me motivated, gives me a creative outlet, and I just feel super organized. And this is pretty much like the way that I like to perfect my planner. So everything that has to do with work, I will go ahead and put here. And then I have a second planner. But this one right here is more of like my scrapbook planner and I'll show you guys inside. This is where I brain dump in the middle of the night when I can't go to sleep. This is where I write my to-do list or I have video ideas. Whenever I jump on a conference call with my manager and we go over ideas or anything that I, any work that I have to do, I'll make sure to write it down in one of these notebooks. So everything is in one place and I just, I love this so much. It's so portable. It's a little bit smaller than the other one. This is a Foxy Fix planner. It's so gorgeous. You can customize the color of the leather that you want, the color of the stitching, the color of the bands, how big you want it, how wide, um, how many uh, bands you want inside. And you can even customize the pockets that are inside, which I will show you guys. And I have my initials on here, BV Belinda Villa. And then I also wanted this embossed on the front, and it says Boss Babe. So I thought that was so cute. And right here, it's just um, embossed and says Foxy Fix. So let me show you guys. Oh, this little accessory right here is from the Planner Society. And they have the cutest little accessories in every single one of their subscription boxes. So I do recommend them. And here's a quick peek on the inside. So right here, I just made myself a dashboard. I have some stickers right here. We have some page flags from also the Planner Society. And then on top here, I have some of my business cards. And I get so many questions about my, my business cards because of the gold foil on there. And these are from Moo.com and have several different ones. So I'll just keep them there whenever I'm working. Sometimes people ask me like, oh, what do you do? Or anything like that. So they're really nice and 
handy. Then we have some gorgeous notebooks. These are from Teresa Collins, and I'm pretty sure you can find them at Joanne Fabrics, um, maybe Hobby Lobby and Michaels, but I know for sure Joanne Fabrics and Michaels. And right here, I just have some lists of things that I have to do, um, and it just keeps me really well organized. Then we have this right here. This one right here is from Erin Condren and I just put a, um, what is it, like a plastic cover over it and I made my own design because I wanted <laughs> something a little bit different than what the cover was. Um, and then right here I just have a bunch of different things too. I showed you guys like the different things that I write down, like this is my to-do list and just a bunch of information. Okay, and then the very last thing that I have here is a planner, and this one is from either TJ Maxx or Home Goods, and it was only $7.99. I don't take too much time decorating it. If I have time, I will. If not, it's not a big deal. Um, for example, I was so excited to get this planner that I decided to like put stickers and washi tape all over it. But if you look into February, it's still plain Jane, and that's okay, because this is usually what it looks like. So I don't know if it's too bright and you can't really tell, but I just have things written all over the place. This is like a scrap um, planner where I can plan things ahead, and if they don't happen, I can scratch them off. And I just feel like that planner doesn't have enough space in each of the dates for me to write down all the things that I have to do, and therefore I have two of them. So this is strictly for work and this is for like everything else in between. Let me show you guys what else is inside and I have all of my chargers or anything that's needed for my laptop in here. So like um, for my cell phone, also my hard drive um, that I use in order for me to um, be able to edit big files, especially high, higher quality videos. All right, next we have this little pudge right here, and this is from Cloth and Paper. I met the owners of this brand, and they are so sweet, such genuine good people, so that's why I love their products, and everything is just super high quality. You can just tell the quality is really amazing, and this is one of their pouches. They carry all kind of office supplies, so planners, pens, notepads, folders, um, planner inserts, all kinds of things. Check them out if you haven't already because I absolutely love all of their products. And this is such a cool little pouch. Look, it's an accordion style pouch and I'll show you guys everything that's inside. So I like that it keeps me really well organized and things are separated. So in here we have a memory card or we have several actually, several memory cards since I do, um, film pretty big files. Sometimes I need a variety of different cards and it just helps keeps me organized. I got this little case from Amazon. Then we have this card and this actually used to cut my washi strips. Then we have these little clips and I think these are from PS Sticker Co. Clips um, and they're really cute. I got them when I was at the Chicago Planner Conference. And then this little clip right here, I don't know what shop it came from, but this was in our swag bag from the Chicago Planner Conference too, and I thought it was just really cute. Then we have some washi tape from Simply Gilded. Oh my gosh, so gorgeous. She has the most gorgeous washi tape in her shop. You guys have to check her out if you haven't already. And I also am wearing her bangle. And look, it looks kind of like her washi tape because it has the bows on there. And I just have it along with my other uh, bracelets all the time. I wear this like every single day. This right here is really sentimental to me. A friend gave this to me and I'll explain more about this in a later video because I feel like I can really get into it. But this is one is also really special to me. And then I have my Pandora bracelet and um, this is just like my traveling Pandora bracelet. I also have a Disney one with all Disney charms but it shows like all the places that we've been like Canada and New Orleans and we have like the Disney castle and the Eiffel Tower, the um, Big Ben Clock Tower from London, a little palm tree, we have a turtle from Cancun, um, the Statue of Liberty, and then the palm tree is from when I went to Coachella with my sister, and we were in Palm Springs. So, such a sentimental little piece with me, and I love all three of these bracelets in case I get questions, because I feel like I'm going to get a lot of questions on those. And then in the back here, I have some stickers from planwithbalunas.com, which is my sticker shop, and then I have some sticky notes from the Planner Society as well, and some really, really really gorgeous big stickers that I got when I was at the Chicago Planner Conference. I also have some lotion. 
I don't go anywhere without hand lotion. My hands are often super dry. The last few things that we have is my wallet, and in here I just keep all of my cards and my cash, and it's so small and petite and cute that I really, really love the size of this because I can fit quite a few items in here. And then I recently got this. I found it pre-loved because Louis Vuitton no longer makes it in this color. When I first bought this and I received it, the inside was pretty dirty because obviously like your keys tarnish over time and so from being on there it left like imprint, it left like marks and it was really really dark. Then I just grabbed a magic eraser and some leather conditioner and I went in and I put on the leather conditioner first and then I went in with the magic eraser and it cleaned it up so good. Look how cool Good that looks. I am very proud of myself. And then I went ahead and I also just polished the hardware on there. The main reason why I did get this is because I noticed that my keys were scratching the inside of my nicer handbags and I'm like, I invested all this money into these handbags. I don't want them to be scratched. So I also made sure to um, get this right here and it's so cute. So this right here, if you guys didn't know, this is called the Tile Mate. And if you can't find your phone or if you can't find your keys, you can press a button and it'll find it for you. Even if your phone is on silent, it will still ring so you can find your phone. And that's another reason why I love it so much because I often put my phone on silent because I'm filming and I don't want any distractions. And vice versa, there's an app on here and if I lose my keys, I can um, track down where my keys are at. And if you lose both... You're out of luck. You're not going to find anything. <laughs> um, but I also have my gym membership and then my Speedway card. It took me forever to hunt this down, so I was so excited when I actually found it. And I got it at a much cheaper price because it was pre-loved. So that is pretty much everything that I have inside my bag. The last few things that I have in here are just like some pens that I bring along with me. Okay, and what helps keep everything nice and organized inside of my purse and also keep the shape of the bag is this right here. It has so many different compartments for you to add things inside. And I also really like how it keeps your purse clean. I love that. I'll have links where you guys can find everything down below. That is everything that I have inside of my work bag. If you guys have made it this far into the video, that means that you really liked it. So please give it a big thumbs up because likes always help out my channel. They let YouTube know that people are engaged and so it's most likely to pop up on other people's feed and therefore bringing more viewers back to my channel. So I would really appreciate it. And also if you guys want to stick around, make sure to subscribe and also turn on your notifications. That way you guys know when I upload a new video, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Muchos besos. Mwah.